Let's look at the Lorenz attractor. Start MATLAB. I'm using MATLAB 2014A. This is the command window. This is the MATLAB command window. There are other windows of MATLAB which are docked on the left pane, but we are looking at the command window right now. So this is the MATLAB command prompt. So you type at the MATLAB command prompt the letters Lorenz. Type Lorenz at the command prompt. And the instant you do that, you have a dialog which opens up. This is the Lorenz Attractor Demo dialog. So where you have four options, you have Start, Stop, the Info, and the Close button. So before we press the Start button, let's look at the Info button and see what information it has. On pressing the Info button, we have the following information. So Lorenz is the plot of an orbit around the Lorenz Chaotic Attractor. This demo animates an the integration of the three coupled nonlinear differential equations that define the Lorenz attractor, a chaotic system which was first described by Edward Lorenz of MIT. So the equations are right here. So they're described in terms of uh, three variables, x, y, and z. They are first order systems. They are coupled systems because each equation has uh, the other variables. First equation has y and x. Second equation has x and z and so on. And there are three parameters which need to be specified for beginning the integration. And the parameters are sigma, rho, and beta. These must be specified. And the initial condition must also be given for integrating these coupled nonlinear differential equations. So in this simulation, uh, which is uh, example simulation, the initial condition is here. This is where the integration begins for certain values of sigma, rho, and beta. Edward Lorenz developed a simplified model of uh, atmospheric convection equations, and these are those equations which we saw in the previous frame as well. It is possible to simulate this in MATLAB. Of course, the demo contains the simulation data, which is displayed on the, on the view like this. So MATLAB simulation may be done by running these commands, these lines in MATLAB on the command window, on this window, on here. So f is a function which defines the set of uh, three differential equations. A is an array containing x, y, and z variables, and t is a time variable. So the this syntax returns the handle to f, function handle to f. And ODE45 is the integration scheme, which integrates the differential equations, which are defined in F. And the data is then saved to the A variable. This is the array containing X, Y, and Z variables. And plot3 is a three-dimensional plot command, which returns the solution. So for the choice shown here, sigma, beta, and rho being these three values, the integration of this produces this data which is shown here. This is, this is the data from the MATLAB simulation. Lorenz system is a system of ordinary differential equations first studied by Edward Lorenz. It is notable for having chaotic solutions for certain parameter values and initial conditions. In particular, the Lorenz attractor is a set of chaotic solutions of the Lorenz system. This is the Lorenz system. This underscores that physical systems can be completely deterministic and yet still be inherently unpredictable, even in the absence of quantum effects. So this is, there is no randomness anywhere and there is no chaotic system influencing these equations, but still the equations behave like, like random systems, but they're not actually random systems. They're chaotic systems. So there is a choice of parameters for which the solution to this coupled nonlinear equations produces chaotic solutions. The shape of Lorenz attractor itself when plotted graphically may be seen to resemble the butterfly. Hence the word butterfly effect came into use. So we now look at the Lorenz attractor simulation, which is simulation of the three coupled differential equations. Upon pressing the start button, the simulation has started with the initial condition as, as is evident from this uh, animation. It's going on. The simulation is ongoing now. It runs normally for about 10 seconds, which could be set by looking at the code of this 
uh, program. Upon pressing the start button again, the simulation has started from a different initial condition. The solution set lies on two planes, which resembles the wings of a butterfly, which is the reason why this is uh, the, the usage butterfly effect came into use. A third time, a third simulation has started with a different initial condition. So these are the regions in the state space where uh, chaotic solutions are exhibited for this couple of differential equations, which is what we are seeing in the solution. A fourth time begins with a different initial condition. And for this also, we see the two wings of the butterfly in two different planes. So this is the Lorenz demo. It's a part of the demo package, demo commands of MATLAB. So another start button press begins the simulation from a different initial condition and simulation goes for about 20 seconds.